you know, I, I like my position of kind of the artsy side of the luthier world, you know, mm -hmm. it's one of, it's always so, so uh, tailored to the guitar, mm -hmm. to the, to the player, sorry, in every way. Um, that it becomes, first of all, all their ergonomic needs, you know, people are players who are overstressing their hands. How can we make this object as easy to play as possible and make it so you can actually play it for a while? Um, and I do achieve that, which is very gratifying. But also then, you know, the woods, the aesthetics, and then we get to the inlay art, which is always an original theme. It's so personal to them on so many layers that... I develop a relationship with every customer mm -hmm. and many of them become lifelong friends mm -hmm. who I visit around the world mm -hmm. um, and, and just love that aspect. But it's more the richness of the transaction between the two of us is so gratifying for both of us, mm -hmm. for them and for me. And it's 180 degrees from our digital culture. It's the mm -hmm. epitome of you know the artisanal culture mm -hmm. and the values of artisanal culture and speaking directly to the human need for tactile experience for mm -hmm. odd audio experience that it's another reason i feel so lucky to be doing this kind of thing because it leaves you satisfied at the end of every day that you're doing something that has some value to people, you know, as well as delivering a tool for their own creativity, you know? Mm -hmm. So it must be a tool as well. But to have all these other layers that work for them so personal, that's the opposite of being a manufacturer and you turn out, you know, a bell curve of results every time. Mm -hmm. And that's why I say, okay, if you want a Martin or a Taylor or a Larave, Go to, you know, half a dozen different stores, play 10 of them, and you will land on the one that speaks to you or that's really good, you know, or you'll find the one that are at the front of the bell curve that are just superb and you'll pass by the ones that are just okay and these ones over here that are crappy, you know, mm -hmm. but I can't afford to turn out crappy or just okay or I'm out of business. Right. They have to be excellent every time. Mm -hmm. And not only for any solo builder, or who's going to order sight unseen, right? They're going to, why take a chance if you can't be sure that at least the minimum of what you're going to get. Mm -hmm. um, but then especially for me doing all the inlay work, like you can see on the posters behind me, right? Mm -hmm. you, you know what I do. And, yeah. you know, if I, if I don't make excellent sounding and playing guitars, I'd be dismissed in a minute. They would mm -hmm. say, oh yeah, grits guitars are gorgeous, you know, buy one mm -hmm. and, you know, put them on the wall. But if you really want a good guitar to play, just get a calling and be done. You know, right, I right. cannot have people thinking that. Yeah, I, yeah. Maybe some do and I can't stop them. But if they play my guitars, they know that's not the case, mm -hmm. you know, and I understand it. And my customers hear me articulate that. So they know that's how I'm thinking mm -hmm. to deliver a, a an excellent tool for them that also has these other multiple dimensions to it. Mm -hmm. And, you know, this is all coming back to why I feel very lucky, really, Jamie. Yeah. And um, and it's just sort of touching on some of the things you're talking about on, on mm -hmm. bringing in other disciplines and, you know, peripherally it's touching on it. But still, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I just I don't know. I, and I, to me, I love being an example of artisanal culture, mm -hmm. you know, in some ways, you know, uh, what can we do? The digital age is here. And we depend on it in so many ways, and it's only going to get more so in la vie, right? Because there's the plus side to it. But mm -hmm. uh, but humans are humans. And until our brains are so rewired, maybe five generations from now, who knows what we'll be like. But at the yeah. moment, we're still carrying with us this need for, you know, base experiences, base human experience, yeah. tactile, audio, emotional. Those are still things every human on the planet still searches for. Thank you for watching and listening. You can find more episodes wherever you listen to your podcasts. And a special thanks to those who support us on Patreon. It's your support that enables us to do this work.